Space Quest, Vohal Strikes Back is a non-commercial fan-made sequel to Sierra's Space Quest series, released in 2011. Topic. Premise When a fallen nemesis returns to wreak vengeance on the galaxy, it's up to space janitor Roger Wilco to tread the treacherous ice world of Radon, outwit an army of simian commandos, and lead the indigenous people in a revolution to take back the planet and defeat the diabolical mad scientist Sludge Vohal. Topic. Development Beginning in April 2002, the game was developed by a group of volunteers in their spare time for over nine years. The developers used the free adventure game studio engine, created by Chris Jones. At the time of its release, Vohal Strikes Back was arguably the largest Space Quest game ever created, likely exceeding each of the games in the original series in terms of gameplay time and volume of content. The game contains approximately 90 playable rooms, 70 speaking characters, 8,000 lines of dialogue, 7,700 sprites. 50 pieces of music, 80 inventory items, 60 to 70 unique ways for Roger Wilco to DA. As of January 2012, the game does not yet have a voice pack, but production on one is underway. Several authors of Vohal Strikes Back, most notably Chris Ushko, also worked on another fan-made sequel, Space Quest, Incinerations, which was in development for over six years and released just a few weeks later, in January 2012. Reception On Rock, Paper, Shotgun, Richard Cobbett gave the game a favorable review, noting a shaky start, but calling the game an excellent tribute to the series and a very enjoyable game in its own right. That is, funny, surprisingly long, and well worth the download. Cassandra Kaw of IndieGames.com noted that Though greatly lacking in the voice pack department, Vohal Strikes Back makes up for it by offering charm, charisma and no small amount of humor. In his review of the game at Adventure Gamers, Rob Murrant pointed out a clash between the background and character art, but mentioned that, despite the graphical mismatch, once you start playing it's not off putting in any way, and once you're well into the story you'll barely even notice the two contrasting styles. Combined with an excellent soundtrack and effects, slick point and click interface and clever, amusing storyline, there's little to complain about VSB's production quality. Ending the review with as it is, Vohal Strikes Back is an excellent indie release, and one that no Space Quest fan should miss." Jeff Mattis of Shacknews has commented on the early parts of the game by saying, "...I've only played a short bit of it so far, myself, but from what I can tell, it's well written and funny, and seems to do an adept job at capturing the irreverent style and humor of its six official predecessors." The game currently holds an "...overall enjoyment," rating of 91% on the Adventure Game Studio website. At the 2011 AGS Awards, the game won the award for Best Non-Player Character and was nominated for Best Gameplay, Best Background Art and Best Music.